guys, this is your host, Ozu Sun, and today we got, oh, we got something out of the box. Yeah, the shipment has arrived one day before the release date. Oh well, time to open up the box. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, god, god damn. I'm glad I did not buy a Nintendo Switch, but we got the PlayStation 4 Pro, so we got the box, Game worlds come alive. So, let's get straight to unboxing in a moment. You already got unboxed. So let's first things first. So we have the PS4 Pro start guide, quick start. We have the trials for PS Plus trial. Uh, we get a USB cable for the controller, which I'm not going to use. We get an HDMI cable, some speak, some head buds, power cord, and the DualShock 4 controller, a little bit revised, with the glowing light bars, and the crux of it all. Still wrapped in smooth, cold, dark, jet black. Good old baby. Baby's amazing. It's for Pro. The Pro console. Two USB 3.0 ports. Six times Blu-ray drive. Just like the standard PS4. See the sides a little bit curved. I think that's the speaker holes. The back of it. Got the auxiliary power. HDMI 2.0 <coughs> B. USB 3.1 port. And the auxiliary port for camera. Uh, optical port for sound and uh, Ethernet port. So you can see the back fence. Oops. Shows all the licensing logos underneath the console. So let's do a comparison. Side by side in a moment. So we got the PS4 and the PS4 Pro side by side. This is a little longer. Pro is a bit wider. And a bit thicker. So in terms of height. They're all almost similar, except Pro is a slightly bigger. So there we have it. We had snapped open.
Okay, we remove the screws. Pop out the hard drive. So what we have here is a HGSD Western Digital 1 terabyte 5400 RPM 2.5 inch drive. So we're gonna have to swap this out in a moment. So we swapped out with a one terabyte 850 Evo solid state drive reformat at FAT32. So we're gonna stick it back in and as she says, so plop it in. Oh yeah, I did it the wrong way. I'm supposed to put it this way. And it goes right in. Smooth and sleek. Oh yeah, baby. Right. So let's plop it in. Alright, let's pop the drive back in. Mm -mm -mm. That was fun. Yeah. Yeah, truck one. Woohoo. Uh, shit. Yep, we got it assembled. All right, let's move on to the next step. <coughs> so we have the PS4 Pro up and running and started. All right, now this time we're gonna start it. All right, so let's start it, shall we? Hmm. Dual shock and USB cable. All right, let's do it again. <laughs> Detects it. Come on, please wait. It takes a while. It's the first time starting it up on my 4K TV. Come on, come on, come on. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, PS4 will be initialized. I'll, it'll be erased. PS4 Pro, baby. Damn, that shit's fast. Holy fuck. It's initializing. The solid state drive is amazing. Oh shit, that's fast as hell. <coughs> Damn. The Nintendo Switch doesn't even stand a chance.
Takes a while. Holy shit. Damn. Let's. Wow, this thing's pretty fast. Damn. That USB 3.1 is amazing. It's swag. Install speeds are pretty quick. I can go tweet some friends and show off my new purchase. Pretty fast, huh? United States? All right, we got it fully running. Not the backup and restore it. Restore PS4. Oh yay, it works. Holy shit! Hmm. It's gonna be fun. Oh boy. Can't wait. Can't wait. It's gonna take a while to restore 700 gigabytes worth of data.
so it's restoring as you can see four hours left into the mix yep and my PS4 is all set my PS4 Pro I meant fully loaded let's see where it is yep 86100 this is your host Urzu7 have a great day catch you later See ya. Bye now.